and we have hit 50 subs in case most of you guys know so we're on our road to 100 subs thank you to everyone who subscribed so far i'm gonna still try to put out as much content as i can for you guys and we have minnesota gophers playoff baseball versus the coastal carolina chanticleers this is game one in the series if you watched the first playoff game we had uh we played oregon in the wild card game and we beat them oh i got an invitation from bomba Bamba! I'm live currently. Oh, okay. With Gophers Playoff Baseball. Hey. So, yeah, we beat Oregon in the wild card game. Now we play Coastal Carolina in the divisional round. And then the if we beat Coastal Carolina. Yes. And if we beat. Coastal Carolina and advance in this round then we either play Michigan or Arkansas mm. All right, we'll be away this game. They have Dean Penske on the mound. We have Kev Berry We'll be in Coastal Carolina. This is Some college playoff baseball Here we go Yeah Mohammed is back. Yes, he is. I am happy for that. Hold on, I want to make this. Oh, I can't make it a night game. Okay. They have a 99 overall pitcher on the mound. <laughs> You're dead. Great. Game one, dead. Their team is godly. North Carolina beat Clemson in the wild card game. Uh, Stanford's up 2 nothing versus Florida State in the series. Uh, North Carolina's tied with Tennessee 1-1 one, one, and Michigan's down to Arkansas 1-0. Oh. Oh. Coming to the plate now. Here we go. They got Felipe Dean Durango. Penske on the mound. Let's rock this, dude. This Felipe Durango to start us off. Almost right got a double to start off the game. Uh, that hooks fell. If Grandster is going to be watching your uh, one, there, the I need to know when he's going to be able to play. Yeah. Like he's toying with him here. Jesus, that throws gas. 97 too. Oh, God. Right here. He got a swing on a high fastball. You nasty slider. He won all-star. Yeah. <laughs> 0-2 once more. Look out as this bat shatters on impact. But this will wind up foul. Still 0-2. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an Broken bat, Durango still up, and another foul ball. Good first at bat, five pitches already, soon to be six. The next o two. Make that a seven pitch at bats. There will be a come. All in all, game time temperature 63 degrees. A pitch at bat, this will become. Another foul ball. What a start. Wearing him down with some pitches. Another foul ball. This will be at least a 10 pitch at bat. And he fouls it off, but it will be caught by the first baseman. But I'll take that a 10 pitch at bat to start off. Okay. Hmm. Rafael Rodriguez, the contact hitting guru up. Foul ball. Bases are empty, one man in. Another foul ball, 0-2 to Rodriguez. 
Has both great strikeout stuff and exceptional command on the mound to go with it. A rare combination of one that makes him one of the best in the Is he still at the Rangers? Oh, he's Potter. He doesn't walk a whole lot of guys. Well, if you don't walk a lot of guys, that means you have to the right. strike zone. He was a ranger, correct? Stuff like this I don't he racks think so. I think he was a, a ray. A lot of guys that get so strikeouts by I remember that name from this someone. This is one of the few that does it. Not from the Padres, but it was another team. Foul another away. foul ball. Great at bat so far. Two at bats. He's already going to go 16 another pitches two plus. Two full down count down. Now, full now to Rodriguez. Jason Fisher will be next. And, he lays and off that's ball, ball four. four. What an at bat. Base runner here with one away. Just like that. And now moving on to his Jason third batter. Penske's already had 17 pitches. Fisher almost line. hooked that one for a ride. Six. Caught. The catch in the Down the line. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to see you. Digging in now, Clayton Anderson. Clayton Anderson, the power bat now up. Jerkson Profar. He did play for the Rangers. That's what I thought. Oh, Oakland. Mm. Oakland Athletics. That's, a, that's why I remember the name from. First pitch coming. Here it is. A fastball oh, off the play play play. It's ball yeah. one. And there are our umpires. Ball one to Anderson. Strikes is Mr. Ed Drummond. Yeah, Matty. Hey, you know what, Giro? This is one of Swing and a miss. Fair umpire, good ball yeah. and strike umpire. Pretty much straight down the road. That's all you look for, Dan. Just be consistent. I don't care if you're given two to three inches it's off the outside two. corner, but you can't do it on the inside. Penske already stick. over 20 one pitches now this first inning. No player will have a break. But yet has not given up one hit. Here's a topper fouled off to the right, and then right. even the count at two and two. Nice. He may have about 130 pitches, but he's going to get a no-hitter. And there's another full count for us. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. Not he can score all the way from I first. Not do and that. that's a close call, but they call ball four. So Rhea now up. No. We have runner in scoring position. Ball one to Soria. Call like strike one. one, and one. I like how Madison Bumgarner yeah, has 40 right power, but then the rest of my pitchers game. has zero. Find out if he can find his Ball if he two to Surya. We're being really patient two today. Probably the most patient we've been so far. The set and the two and one. Surya fouls it off. Penske is two pitches away from throwing 30 pitches in the first inning. <laughs> so that sounds like Kyle Gibson. Full count for the third time this inning. Oh my God. I don't think he can afford another base runner here. So that can we have the Kyle bases Gibson loaded? Whichever one he feels most comfortable with. That's the and it's a strike three. Swing and a miss. Oh, good. But no. he threw 30 pitches in the first inning. That's good. He might get tired very quickly. Kind of bury on the mound now for the for the golfers. That's a foul ball to start it off for Coastal Carolina. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Yes, sir. Foul ball. 0 and 2. Oh, here's Tommy Pham. Tommy Pham's a Padre. He's pretty well, good. The classic O2 yeah. wasted fastball. He helped Not Tampa Bay. Yeah. 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 He's, he's a Padre, a padre now? In there on that one. Yeah, he's a Padre. In real life. Let him go. Yeah, they let him go. Wow. Again, he sends it out of See, play. One, two. Rays, the Rays are so good at developing players. Like, look, look at what David now. Price I mean, have like, you heard of Brendan McKay? Yes. The, all of your pitches this the hitting pitcher. That's a quality of that. And what does it make you do as a pitcher? You wow, and they've had a good at bat to start off too. Pitches, a Swing and a miss, a but that's an eight pitch at bat for Maze at the plate for it. The chance clears. Chance clears. And they get the first hit of the ball game. First pitch of that at bat. Right up the middle line drive. 
All right, let's see if we can turn two here. He's stealing, and we... He's safe at second. Gosh dang it, I knew he was going to steal. Oh, I thought he took that one yard. Bad pitch placement. Now we'll see if the guys can pick him up. Oh, he swept the Padres. Okay, and so that's going to be a hit. And they score a run to start off the game for them. That's another line drive. Just like that, Coastal Carolina's up 1 0 in game one. And they lost. And that's a fly ball, but it's carrying. Not quite gone. Barely caught. I don't know how he caught that. Two outs now. Invitation from Fear Cypher. The D backs have been ranking Havoc on it. Strike one called Davila. Great job of doubling up the fastball. Strike two called Davila. Oh, we are not Called ball two. Two two to Vila. And uh, strike three. Swing and a miss. But the chance to clear is get on the board first. One nothing. Not great starts from both pitchers. Hey, one still has a no hitter. You are yes. And that will be a leadoff hit for Danny Deardorf. There we go. No hitter, no more. Mm -hmm. Alexis Elias now up. Ah, swings at a terrible pitch. Way up high. I didn't know Archie Bradley could throw 100 miles an hour. What? No way. Yeah, he can. In real life. Isn't he old? No, Archie Bradley is like 27, I think. He looks like he's 40. And he's 27, yeah, he's 27. He's been in the league for quite a while. Elias hits it deep, but that doesn't go very far, I guess. That's just going to be a fly ball, one out. Mariano Masias, the second baseman, now up. I guess our chief Bradley is a god against the Rockies. Holy crap. And Masias just pops one up, foul, and it's caught. Two outs after the leadoff single from Deardorf. Now Orlando Ramirez comes up. The switch hitting catcher. Who's hitting 67 so far in the playoffs. Being back way. Ball well, one. He's been laboring a bit through these first two innings of work. That's 37 pitches. And ideally, he'd be closer to 27 instead. Swing and a miss uh, for Ramirez. Pitch upstairs, but it's one and one. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chasing. And another swing and a miss. Set your sights a little bit lower and control One and two to Clearly trying to control the running game with the slide step here. That's yeah, called that's ball two. Trying to control the running game. Now, the problem with it, though, it has a Penske is now at 40 pitches in two innings. Another off. foul ball. Ooh, we can sweep the Padres at home. Swung on, and and missed, and missed to end. Of the inning. Jesus Christ, your mic just ate crap. Stepping in, Bruno Polero. Morgan Field shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. In there for strike one, 0 oh and 1. What? Ben? Now here's the pitch. Line drive to left. High and on through towards the wall. <laughs> and he's going to get the second out. Uh, when you heard the crack of the bat, you just huh? knew that I was going to get that. down for an extra base hit. Great, great way to start an inning, that's for Perfect. sure. Ryan. Sad. Sad. 
So now to the plate, Trevor Lyon. As he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. Take the pitch for you. Hit in the air out to straightaway left field. Soria moves over a few steps to his right as he's got it for the first out. Now with the play, Josh the playoffs are throwing their 99 overall starting pitcher. And through the first two innings, we already have 41 pitches on him. He has a 41 pitch count. Drifting out to shallow center. In comes the center fielder. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. What the heck happened? It like exploded. Here comes the first pitch. Lifted down the line. And that almost could have went gone, but what? Your mic is like so much feedback. Holy crap. Is it really? Set the yeah. one. Like it's taken several inches below the zone. The heck? In fact. And I can hear you clearly again. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We're gonna unplug my mic. Good time to be a nine-hole hitter right now. More than likely to get a strike two to Chad Looper, the nine-hitter for Chint clears. And foul ball. There is this is fouled off to the left side. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely That's a ground ball to second. And the throw to first is in time by a mile. And that's an out. Kev Berry had 31 pitches through the first two innings. At the plate, Felipe Durango. But their pitcher has what 43, I think. Yeah, 43. At the top of the third. 43. That's going to be a leadoff single for Durango to start off the top of the third. And I might send him here. Should I have him steal? No, I'm not. I'm not. Rodriguez is up. Will that fall? Nope, it won't. Fly ball. One out. Jason Fisher now up for the Gophers. Swinging at a terrible pitch. We've been patient all game, but that was nothing with patience. Durango gets back at first in time. We're going to send him. He's going to steal. And because of a bad throw, Durango is safe at second. He's in scoring position with one out. Oh, Fisher hits it foul. It's now one and two. Swing and a miss on the changeup. That was a good pitch. Good job of making him That's Penske's third strikeout. Strike now, yeah, Gladen Anderson, the power yeah, bat, is up. Really I'll bring in the batter that 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 that's a swing and a miss. And that's just a ground ball hit from Clayton Anderson. That will end the top of the third. No damage done for us. One nothing. I'm not gonna fully warm someone up, but I'm gonna get a pitcher starting to get stretching and loose. I'm gonna start stretching, tossing Jamal Ridley and Calvin Murphy. The wind up and the 0-1. Behind 0 and 2 now. Two strikes now to Devin Mays, the leadoff hitter for Coastal Carolina. Oh, that was close, but a little bit inside. Ball two. I mean, ball one. And what a play by the second baseman. Oh, he didn't get him in time. He took way too long to make that throw. And they're probably they might steal. I don't think they will though. Called ball one. Yeah, the foul ball. 
the NL West has got a pretty competitive game when it comes to third baseman. And that's a foul ball, and he was stealing. Okay. You got Aaron Nato in Colorado. You got Justin Turner in L.A. You got Eduardo Escobar in there. They say he didn't go, so it's going to be 2-2 now. And that's going to be just a fly ball to left field. That's caught. One out. Let's see if we can turn to here. Alvarez is up to bat for Coastal Carolina. Just a little blooper that ends up foul. Strike one. Slur called inside for strike two. And a foul ball. Still 0-2. And strike three, swing in for Alvarez. That's Barry's third strikeout so far. I didn't even know Joe Control was taking the Rangers. You didn't? I don't even remember that. Connor King. Must be a power bat for the chance to clear. 144 home runs in the last five seasons, it says for him. I just know that. Swing and miss. Against South Pass, however, he has historically had a lot he more was difficult. Well known in LP. Hey, I can't have one of my best left Three, one. fishing for balls off the plate. Vincent Vila is on deck for the Chanticleers. Three one count. And that's ball four. Vincent Vila is now out for the Chanticleers. Ball one. Vicente Vila is in with two away as he takes a ball, one and oh. And he won't ball find two. either. It's two and oh. Got to find a way to execute either a good fastball down and a swing and a miss. Something off speed for a strike. You cannot miss over the harder plate in these situations. The hitter is on high alert. Swing and a miss, strike two. And it's two and two now. And that's a ground ball. And we just toss it to second. That will end the third inning. Still tied. No, not tied. One nothing. Soria will lead it off for the Gophers. Foul ball. Especially with runners in scoring position, those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. That's ball one. Densky, and this is fourth inning. Now his pitch count is good. Fourth inning now, 53 pitches, that's all it. And it hits Saria, the leadoff batter. That'll be a leadoff hit by pitch, so he'll be at first. Danny Deardorff, the lefty now up. That's gonna be a foul ball. Ball one. And that's hit the first. Does he knock it down? He does. But he didn't flip it to the pitcher. He just hanged on to it. So they'll count that as a base hit. We have runner at second at first. No outs. And Elias sends a blast. That ball's gone. Three run home run for the Gophers. Hey. So a three run shot to right center field. His first homer here in the series. And with it, they've left in front now. Three you know what time it is. Bomba. Bomba. Well, with no outs, you can afford to put a single. You can afford to put a single. You can afford to just caught too much of the plate. Now he's back to the bottom. No outs. There you go.
Let's go. 3 1 Gophers. I just hit an absolute blast with that water. <laughs> Strike three for Messiah. One out. But we get a three run bomb to give us the lead. Gophers up. Orlando so Ramirez is now up. Okay, I'm sorry, but the Arizona Diamondbacks have one of the cleanest Ramirez uniforms in the league, no doubt. Like the normal He's ones? Of years at like the their home level, ones really points are points so clean. It's a foul ball to Ramirez, 0-2. Oh, Penske now at 65 pitches on his pitch count. That's yeah, a ball inside. What I didn't like was their two, the ones that they wore back in 2001 when they won the World Series. Those look really ugly. That's going to be a line drive hit up the middle. Eight the center fielder up a little bit. That will be a single for the catcher, Orlando Ramirez, the switch hitter. Felipe Durango now up. He's one for two so far. It's a God, here comes the feedback. I think you're right. It's inside. And, oh, uh, God. Poor base on the He gets it. And Mike's broken? Yeah, because it's like. <laughs> Strike two oh. to Drango. Hold on, I need to check something out with my mic. That hit the dude right in the stomach. Hopefully it's better now. I could use my other mic too, but. And that's gonna be a blooper to end the fourth inning, but we get a three run home run from Alexis Elias, the right fielder, to give us a 3-1 lead for your Minnesota Gophers. Hopefully we can get Barry to go one or two more innings. The postseason, send it. Yeah. Send it. And that's a ground ball to first base for the leadoff batter for the Chanticleers, and that's one out. Start off the bottom of the fourth. In once again. Trevor Lyon now up for the chance to clear his called strike one. Low and outside. Expect the guy on the mound to keep attacking the zone. He wants a quick inning, so and that's foul. O2 to, to Trevor and Lyon. Foul ball. And, and he doesn't bite with the slur. One, one two. two. Oh, and on. that's just going to be a little right blooper side. to second. Two Lucia outs. Takes charge out there and he stays with it for the second out. Josh Cash now up. He's up for one so far. Kev Berry now Josh past Cash 60 pitches. For his as he looks at a ball. It's Through one three and two thirds of an and inning so far. Right 60 pitches. On, yeah. I mean through um. There's a strike with the breaking ball. That's how you open up the outside part. Yeah. Pound two balls in and they get right. And that's a ground ball to short. That will end the fourth inning. Oh, bad throw, but scooped by Anderson. Go for still up 3 1. And that's that ball's hit deep. But caught a little bit in front of the warning track. Penske, the 99 overall starting pitcher for the chance to clear 72 pitches through four and one thirds of an inning. Swing and a miss for Fisher. That's a ball taken. Ooh, swing and miss on the changeup. And that team momentum. Ooh, that's a big fire right there. Oh, you're doing March to October? Hey, sweep the Padres. Sweep, sweep. That's a foul ball. I could acquire CJ Crone and I could put... 
This is the funniest thing. So if, I would, if I would want CJ Crone, I would have to trade his brother, Kevin Crone. And called strike three. I don't know why I didn't swing at that. Called strike three to Fisher. Do I want to make my lineup even stronger with that in CJ Crone, or do I want a 17 year old prospect that's already a 73 overall? Which is CJ Crone? I no, mean, uh, CJ. Kevin. No, Jason Dominguez is 17 years old. He's a 73 overall, and he's an A potential. Swing and a miss. Terrible hat from Anderson there. Strike three swinging. I would give up less for CJ Clone than what I would give up for Jason Dominguez. This might be Barry's last inning pitch here in the fifth, but we will see. <laughs> That's amazing, trading a brother for brother. <laughs> I have to do it. Yes, I got CJ Oh, two to Chad Looper. Fouled Another away. foul ball. Player lock CJ Crone performed well for a season-long boost. <laughs> Three! Three! There we go, Looper. The nine hitter strikes out. Now Devin Mays the lead off for the chance to clear us up. And they say he went across the plate. And that's a foul ball. 0 oh, 2 to Devin Mays. And Barry gets him swinging on the slur. Two outs. That's Barry's fifth strikeout. He's wheeling and dealing right now. Hey, this is a huge huh. at-bat you know, here. This pitcher wants to miss that he needs to improve his back. And that's hit up. to second base. That will end the fifth the inning. Third, Your gopher still with the 3-1 lead over the chance of clears. And then CJ Crone's batting 250. AC, God, months. welcome to the stream. Digging in once again. Welcome back. He's got to be looking for vengeance. Soria now up. Oh my God, CJ Crone's batting 340 against lefties. Jesus Christ. I want to see if he can get through something right here. And he's facing a right. Uh -oh. They're keeping in Penske right now, but they're warming up two relievers. So this might be his last inning. Ooh, oh change up. Penske has thrown 85 pitches here at the top of the sixth. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And a swing and a miss Crone. for Saria. Crone's first at bat is a diamond back ground ground to a double play. Does that sound like CJ Crone? Yes. Holy cow. Foul ball for Deardorff. Next at bat for CJ Crone. Swing and a miss for Deardorff. Strike two now. God dang it, Crone. Run, Crone. Run, Crone. Run. And that's just a little dribbler. Can Deardorff beat it out? He doesn't. Penske picks it up and throws it to first in time. Two outs. Alexis Elias, who hit the three-run bomb earlier. What can he do here? CJ Oh God! Elias sends a blast! Is this back-to-back -back home runs for Elias? No, it's caught on the warning track. That will end the top of the sixth. This will probably be Kev Berry's last inning here. Crone did not sixth have a inning. First and first pitch of the sixth inning. Ground ball to short. And once again, Anderson has to scoop it. Make a good throw, please. Let's see. Let's warm up Ridley a little more. What's up, Rob? Welcome. Welcome to the stream. We got some playoff golfers baseball here. Oh, no player boost for CJ Crone, and we get a cold. Here's the first Good. Pitch to him. Great. King Called high with the slur for a strike. A one count. Here's I the like pitch. how I ask for a catcher, and then and instead in I get a first base. Hole, what kind of bull crap is that? This is one of the things that makes Doing so good, Rob. How are you? Welcome. Able to pound his own oh, ball short, uh, Doing good. Oh, Rob. Foul ball. Yes, he is. Hey. 
What's going on, Rob? Is there name changes? Um, not for this. But I know you like the NCAA 14 football with Vandy, and that will. C we'll either have our next stream for that tonight or tomorrow. That's a deep pit bull caught on the warning track by Elias. Two outs. Who's in the background? That is Sar Bombagami. Strike two. Can Barry get a strikeout on Via? Slurve. Oh no, Via hit that one pretty hard, but that's right to center field. That land the sixth inning. Gopher is still up 3-1. And Dean Penske's taken out. Now it's the 5'9", 215 pound pitcher. Orlando Ray is it now. Rob said, what up, what's up, Bamba? What's up, oh, the pitcher tried to field it. Oh, but he still gets out. All right. Orlando Ramirez now up. The switch hitting catcher. Oh, good. This, the San Francisco Giants can't lose another 62 games, or they'll all be eliminated from the big We're not even to the all-star break yet. What the actual break? Oh, God. And Orlando got a little bit under it. That's a pop-up. Two outs now at the top of the seventh. Uh, in my opinion, who's the best MLB player in the last three years? The same player who has in the last five years, Mike Trout. Exactly. Uh, Yelich has come, uh, come around. Uh, he's at a slow start. Yeah. I wouldn't say no. I wouldn't say he's done better than Trout the last three years, but no one has. No one has done better than Trout in the last. I don't think anyone's done better than Trout the last decade. Hey, Aaron Judge's rookie year, though. Yeah. Drango swings at a terrible pitch inside. One, two now. If this was a 162 game season, could you imagine the amount of home runs yeah, to fly ball? Right now? You like Mike Trout? He's your second favorite ball. player. Who's your number one? Nelly Cruz. Who's your favorite player? That ball's High hit deep. Ball that like ball's carrying a little bit in front of the warning track. That, that will end the top of the seventh. We will see if we'll take out Kev Berry or not. Like my favorite player of all time is going to be Mal. Kev no Berry, what, starting Mal, pitcher, Mal, Mal, is 83 Mal. pitches. He's your favorite? Yeah. Mauer? Oh, yes, Dustin Mauer, Pedroia. That's your Dustin favorite? Pedroia. I like it. Where has he gone? Like he is Oh, he's a minor leader now. Like double. Looked like he was cheating a heater right there. A I remember in like 2017, the dude was like unbelievable. Oh, and two, here it comes. And now he's like falling Fast off a cliff, like an actual cliff. Well, he certainly wasn't intimidated on the mound right Same there. Same thing with the uh, six strikeouts. Yeah, that's true. I have a, uh, my glove is an A2000, and it's the same type of glove that Dustin Pedroia uses. And that's, what a play by the shortstop, can he make the throw? Scoots by Anderson, two outs! What a throw and what a play! Then Mike again is having a shooting. And now I can't get that. Hello? Dustin, oh he said Dustin is injured due to his weak ankles. Weak, so he is what he must have weak ankles. I mean, he's probably pretty fragile at this point of his career. 
He's, he's, he's pretty old, though, what is he? Probably yeah, close to 40, maybe? 30-something? I mean, hey, nobody can... He's on the 60-day injured the list? Team. Holy crap. Jesus. Blind Blind drive to third, but it's caught to end the seventh inning. What a performance from Kev Barry on the mound. Now they bring in a 5'10 pitcher, 180 pounds. At the age of 28 years old, Evan Elmore now in for the chance of clears. I don't think we'll ever be able to find Oh, he's a sidearm pitcher. Okay, that's a bit of a little bit of a high fastball. made so much to this game than... Nelson Cruz. Yeah. I don't, I don't see us finding another 40-year-old that has that's at the power of Nelson Cruz. That ball's hit deep. Is that ball gone? It's carrying. Caught. He basically dove for it with his arms. Hit the wall. Well, I don't think he quite did, but. Ow. There's two outs. Now we're swinging at terrible pitches, but we're being aggressive. He hits it into the shift. Perfect hit from Anderson. Can he get two? He's rounding. And he's in there. Safe at second. His helmet flies off. Hits it at the shift to the other side. No one's there. And they intentionally walk Saria. Okay. If we can get a base runner on here, I'll take a walk. So then we'll have a grand slam opportunity for Elias, I think, who had the three-run home run earlier. Danny Deerdorf now up. Deerdorf swing and a miss. It's becoming more and more common in today's game to see relievers like this. Oh, that can of course, CJ Crone's on the bench. So and then a terrible swing. This guy's a sidearm bringing gas. 99 miles per hour for the sidearm of an Elmore. Oh, good. Ready on 0 and 2. And that's going to be a hit. Send Deerdorf home. We're sending him home. He is safe at the plate by a hair. Just, just in time. That was a very aggressive call. We sent Anderson, the power first baseman, home, and they take out Evan Elmore. In comes Christopher J, a 6'4", 220 pitcher. I knew that trade was worth it. A lefty. Okay. That's what they're now, fifth or lead pitcher now, fifth or fourth. And that ball smoked. One run will score. Maybe two. Send him home. Send him home. Two runs. No, he's out of the plate. Deardorf is called out at the plate. But we get a run after that hard hit ball from Alexis Elias, who had the three-run bomb earlier. So he has four out of our five runs from him. Dang. And that's called strike one. This will be Cadbury's last at bat. He's pitching to their nine hitter. And that ball, oh, that could have been a double, but it ends up foul. Thank God. And strike like three to Looper. What a night for Kev Berry. What a performance. He ends it with seven Ks. And in comes the lefty. What do you want, dude? Calvin Murphy. What? Where am I? Where do you think I am? Are you in Rochester or something? Yes. Yo, do you know Will is? Will? Uh, that's a tag. That's so a tag, to to that Calvin Murphy, the lefty, now in. That's, that's a tag. And they started off off Murphy with a double. That ball traveled a bit. And he'll come into second with a one away. First hitter Murphy faces is a double. 
takes one, so maybe they can string together a few. Call. Strike one. That's a, that's a tag. Swing and a miss, strike two. And swing and a miss, strike three. Two outs. You know what? Bye, Cookie. How is that not a strike? Well, he punched out the last guy, but he didn't 2 -0. Any from the Am I having any more streams tonight? I'll probably have one or maybe two. I got you guys. Hey, that's a walk. They have runner at second of first. A home run for them would be huge. But if they get a the bases loaded, a home run would tie it. Strike three in the eighth inning. Murphy gets two Ks. He did give up a double, but he gets the two Ks and gets his job done. Now Mariano Masias will face off first the lefty, Christopher J. And that ball's hit pretty softly to first base. One out. Up yeah, I'll either have. I mean, if Black Space, Bomba, and Grandster get their games done today, I might stream Madden 20. If not, uh, I'll get you with a NCAA 14 Vandy stream. It's kind of hard to do when freaking Grandster is never online. The only time he is online is playing NCAA. Yeah. I mean, you can text him. I could, and I could try to bother you guys. Uh, Rob says, hey, son, do you have the game up. Hunter C-O-T-W? No, I don't. I do not. Strike three, Ramirez, the catcher. No game, Rob, yeah. and the game is so good. Felipe Durango. He's one for four. And we played it until, like, two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Call of the Wild, okay. Yeah, I don't have that Call game. Of the Wild. That sounds like a movie. It, it is a movie. I watched it. Swing and miss at the splitter in the dirt. 0 oh, 2 for Durango. Can he get a hit here? Kendig said, hey, Bomba, you have it. No, I don't. Oh, I thought I said you do. Alright, one, two. That will. Oh, the first baseman can't field it cleanly. Oh, what? They called him out. We will head into the ninth and final inning. I'm going to warm up Eric Meyer, the closer. But for the ninth, I'm going to put in the 66 overall, Kelly Whiteside. Pretty sure he's a sidearm lefty. So, I mean, he has four he runs to work with. He should be able to uh, not give up four runs here. That will be the show, not man. I need to give him some innings. 1-1 this is the guy right here. One, one to Vincente Avila, who is hitless so far today. 0 oh, for 3. Should I, should I start Dante Culpepper against... Why would you? Answer, no, just to confuse him. <laughs> and that's a leadoff. That's going to be a double. If he can get to second in time. Yes, he will. That will be a leadoff. Stand up double for the chance to clear. Uh-oh. Well, they have a big inning. Try to keep this game alive. And he fouls this one off. Okay. Uh, Black Space, you said you're playing Fall Guys. Okay. I'll join. I'll join after this stream. Dang, Bombinson, you should have it. It's only $30 on the PlayStation Store. $30? Jesus. Yeah, only $30. I need to save for PS5 or something. Yeah, it gets the Wi-Fi router. Do you think you're gonna get the PS5? I'm going to. I yeah. really want to. Because I oh. think I'm hoping this show is gonna look so much better. Oh yeah. No, like I feel like you're just gonna feel just like it's in you're in the game, and they're gonna send him home. Can Durango gun him out? 
No, he can't. Took way too long to throw. Even with the TS4 with the yeah. seven years that has come along, it's great. It's, they've yeah. done really well with this. Oh my god. New, new gen console, so they scored a run. It's five to two. And another hit. A home run for Coastal Carolina ties it. And they have no outs. Hey, I'm on uh -oh. go to do with space and party. I I'll join in a minute. Okay. Dan, I'll bring in Eric Meyer, the closer. Alright, Bomb is out of the stream chat. See ya. Uh, I'll chat in a minute. Alright. Foul ball. 1-2 to Josh Cash, the 8-hitter. And he fouls it off still, 1-2. Can we get him with the circle change? No, he doesn't bite at it. 2-2. Two, two. Can we get him with the slider? Another foul ball. Oh, are you kidding me? Off the wall! One run scores for Coastal Carolina. Now it's three to five, and they have two runners in scoring position. And a home run for them wins it. Swing and miss. Their nine hitter Chad Looper is up, and he's hitless so far. Swings it another bad pitch. Almost called strike three. I don't know how that wasn't. And he swings at strike three, one out. Okay, as long as the runner from second doesn't score, we'll win this game. Come on. Taking ball one. And that's going to be hit softly to first, and we step on it. One run does score. But they're down to their final out. The runner at third. Called ball one. Can Meyer get the save and win it for the Gophers? He went! Strike two now! They're down to their final strike. Foul ball. Oh god, don't say a cluck. Black space. Off the pitcher! Can we still get him? Got him! What a way to win it for the Gophers here in game one! That one gets hit off the pitcher's leg. Touch it there, then it would have been a tie game. Wow, Alexis Elias for sure, the player of the game. He had the three run bomb and then the line drive that he pulled for a single. Actually, no, that was a double, RBI double. Eric Meyer gets the save. We win game one in this series in the playoffs versus Coastal Carolina. Big win, big win. What a good pitching performance from Kev Berry. I knew they were going to put some uh, damage up on us in the ninth, and they did. We take game one. Let's go. In Coastal Carolina, we win it versus their ace. Dean Penske takes the loss. And we'll just advance to that next game. They have Buck Shalver on the mound and we'll have Francisco Ve Veras. Thank you for watching. It's been sensational. 3-1-1. Make sure to go subscribe to Sar Bamba. Thank you for him being in the party chat. And I'm out. Peace, guys. Oh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Check out the podcast that we're trying to get started. Uh, the Sports Gamers podcast includes... Myself, Sensational 311, uh, Grandstar 88, Sour Bomb Gaming, and Black Space.